Hey there, welcome to Life Noggin. So dreams are a part of our everyday lives, but have you ever wondered why we dream? Well, you're about to find out. Dreams are sequences of images, ideas, emotions, and sensations that occur in the mind during sleep mainly during the REM or rapid eye movement stage. REM seems to be linked to a cluster of memories. This may last five to 20 minutes, three to five times a night, and sometimes even up to seven. On average, in eight hours of sleep, two of them are spent dreaming. Dreams have been viewed as a connection to the unconscious. They range from normal and fun to overly severe and bizarre. Dreams are generally outside the control of the dreamer, with the exception of lucid dreaming. Lucid dreaming is being aware that you are dreaming. You can have control over the role in the dream or be able to change the imagery and experiences in the environment. Pretty cool, right? There is an increased amount of activity in the parental lobes, making lucid dreaming a conscious process. Some researchers suggest that dreams serve no real purpose, while others believe that dreaming is essential to mental, emotional, and physical well-being. Sigmund Freud's psychoanalytic theory of dreams suggested that dreams were a representation of unconscious desires, thoughts, and motivation. And then we have the activation synthesis model of dreaming. Circuits in the brain become activated during REM sleep, which causes areas in the brain involved in emotions, sensations, and memories to become active. The brain synthesizes and interprets the activity and attempts to find meaning in these signals. All the dreams in your head are just your brain trying to stitch some memories together. So what is the best dream that you've ever had? Let us know in the comments section below and I'll be down there to respond. Or tell us, what should we talk about next? Don't forget to come back every Monday for a brand new video. I'm Blocko, this has been Life Noggin. Don't forget to keep on thinking.